everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 46, and this is war number nine. We just got three more wars till this season is over. And look at who we're going up against. NYC Guardians. Why are we facing them? I don't know. But anyway, we I guess we were doing too good. Um, let's see, who did they ban? Okay. Hercules, uh, Warlock, and Ghost. Hopefully they're not pushing. A lot of uh, alliances I've heard at the uh, higher levels aren't pushing because this meta is so crappy. All right, let's see who they, what they did here. All right, so first up, we've got a global defender and its spot. Uh, so I'm probably going to end up bringing in uh, Nick Fury. Not going to even play around. All right. Then we've got... Hmm. Bishop. Who do I want for Bishop? I mean... OG Iron Man can do it. Uh, infamous Iron Man can do it. Okay, we see there, so that's a Magneto. So I really need to bring someone who's going to be able to handle that Sandman as well. Hmm. I think I'm going to bring Spider-Man uh, Stark Enhanced in. So Nick Fury, Spider-Man Stark Enhanced, and Magneto. That should be able to handle uh, my path. And then we'll see if I have anyone uh, he thinks is going to be good for one of these guys. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. So that, that's going to be the plan. So uh, Nick Fury, definitely for that spot. Um, I might swap him out for someone else, but I think Nick Fury will be the safest. Uh, Spider-Man, Stark in hands for that Bishop. And for that Sandman. And Magneto for that future Ant-Man. All right. Let's get on with the fighting. All right. We going in with Magneto, Lady Deathstrike, my secret weapon, and... Nick Fury. Now, I told you guys before that with this meta, it just seems to be a better idea to just go in and either prevent them from, you know, getting their unblockable or whatever, nuke it down before they even have a chance, you know, something. And We've had some pretty good uh, good luck doing that, all right? So, Spot is an annoying defender, no matter what. However, anytime I see Spot, and I think I mentioned this earlier, um, I always think of Nick Fury. Now, I have been using Nick Fury in Alliance Quest. I had to switch it up. Um, it's one of the reasons I leveled up my um, uh, Cosmic Ghost Rider for use in AQ as a replacement for Nick Fury, and it's been working great. Just look at this. Just nuke him down. And and even if I get hit real hard, who cares? I'm still gonna try to, you know, evade it, but even if I do, you know, I mean, even if I don't, doesn't matter, but shh. And yes, my Nick Fury is rank five and ascended. Very, very nice. Now, here we go. We got Bishop. Here's a little... I don't know if you guys know this about Lady Deathstrike. But when she's fighting a mutant, um, I believe it's just mutants. I could be wrong. It might not be just mu mutants. When she has them under a heal block, they can't get unblockable. Don't know if you knew that. 
I love evading that anyway. I don't evade all of it usually, but as long as it's not unblockable, I don't care. And with her, even if it was unblockable, there you go. That time I evaded the whole thing. Um, I was just practicing because, I mean, there's no risk really unless he was able to take her out in one hit. She's going to heal it up. Okay, here we go again. Here we go. Just getting, you know, practice. And then down he goes. Now, you're going to see Lady Deathstrike again. And you're going to see the other reason that I like Lady Deathstrike for this meta. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. Next up. I forgot. Hold on. See, I got... I'm doing, like, multiple things here. All right. <clears throat> you already know who we're taking um, future Ant-Man with. That's going to be the Magneto fight. And pretty much all of these fights look pretty much the same. You know, it's Magneto. I'm going to do parry heavy. I'm going to wait in the beginning. Get that magnetize on him. Let his uh, armor up, wear out, and then just parry heavy him to death. Block all of his specials, because they're not going to do any damage to me. Um, well, not much damage, anyway. And uh, the only thing you have to watch out for is if you don't have the Pacify Mastery uh, maxed out or, or any points in it like me, he does have a chance that he'll get his armors. See, that armor right there is going to go away, and he may or may not get more armor. So you have to watch for that. Now, if you have Max Pacify, he's not going to get those armors. But even without Max Pacify, he may still not get any armors because of the Magnetize, but he might. So you just kind of have to um, keep an eye out there. And as you can see, I'm just parry heavy, parry heavy block like i said not much damage at all and with him i like to go to the special three because he does have a cap on the damage you can do in um one hit so like my special two won't have the punch against him that i really want it to but like this oh he going down even if the special three don't take him out, he'll go down to the shrap. Boom. And done. Now, this next fight is Sandman. If you watched some of my previous war videos this season, I took Sandman on that node that I just did here with uh, Spider-Man Stark in hands. Worked out beautifully. But I think Lady Deathstrike is a better option. And you're going to see why. In, in this particular fight, Sandman is immune to a whole bunch of things. But guess what? He's not immune to rupture. So I want you all to watch. Pay close attention to her health bar. All right. So I'm getting these ruptures in. Okay. Look at that. Boom. Boom. Oh, wait. I got hit. Oh. Look at her health bar. Y'all saw me get hit, right? Or did you? Did I get hit? Hmm. Can't tell. Come on. Okay. Now you hit me. Oh, wait. Wait. What? What? Oh, oh wait. I got hit again? What? Hmm. Maybe I didn't. Yeah, buddy. Secret weapon. Oh, wait. Another one. Oh, no. I got hit. Oh. Oh, full hit. Or did I? <laughs> What's that? What's my health at now? Hmm. I was taking a few specials to the face. Mate. So I decided to practice my evades. Oh, yeah, baby. She's not the fastest, and I still wish she could do a little bit more damage with her um, ruptures, but 
As you can see, she's my secret weapon. Phew. Look at that. What's my health looking like? Man. So yeah, much better options than my Spider-Man Stark in hand. Look at this. Woo! He evaded that one. And he's down. Well, well, well. Lady Deathstrike kicking it. And she's available as a 7-star, but I don't know if I would use the 7-star over this one. Uh, this one is SIG 200. So I might not uh, use the 7-star if I get her over the 6-star. Uh, Alright, what was the next fight um, that I had here? I can't remember. Okay, no, I think that was it. All right. So this war against NYC Guardians, yeah. But we'll be back and you'll see how this war ended. And we're back and no surprise, we lost. I don't think we have ever beaten NYC Guardians. And just so you guys know, NYC Guardians are usually master level alliance, but as I've mentioned before with this meta especially, a lot of the top uh, alliances are not pushing because this uh, war is, I mean, this uh, war season meta is just horrible. And so they're just like, oh, you set it up so that we were going to have to use a lot of resources? Well, we're not going to do it. We just won't compete the way that we were before. And so we have these matchups, and so we knew what was going to happen. Okay, we definitely knew it. So no surprise there. Anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.